Oh, gum. All right, and deep chat, there you are. Boom, yay, we're all good. Hello, friends. I have to remember now that I'm YouTube live streaming that I can't swear in the first like 30 seconds of um, my uh, video, my stream. I hate YouTube's new rules. I have like a five hour stream and then it gets almost no ads on it and no monetization because I say the A word in the first 30 seconds. Really feels good. I love YouTube for that. <clears throat> the A word. Mm -hmm. This has happened three times now in three different streams in the past two weeks where I have get, I've been getting no ads. So the money goes down a lot just because of that and it really sucks. YouTube is ass. There, I can say it now. It's been one minute so I can say YouTube is ass. <clears throat> wow, Dynasty, so cheesy. What happened, dude? Oh, I just realized, where'd my water go? Oh, I have no water. Hold up, I'll be right back. I got water. Oh, hi, everybody. How we feeling? Wait, today's Friday, right? Yeah, today's Friday. So you made it. Two weeks in this space. We've done it. National Cheese Day? Is it actually National AT Cheese Day? Or are you making that up? <clears throat> Dude, Yakuza... Eight comes out next week. That's actually crazy. <clears throat> there we go. Some Den Junjin Meshi anime. What even is that? Oh, um, yeah, I, I still am watching Bleach. I haven't had a lot of time off stream actually to, to watch it, but I'm on episode 20 now. We're getting real far. Episode 20 of Bleach. Man, I forgot how cheesy this anime is, but I still love it. I don't know why. <clears throat> I wish I could turn off- wait, can I turn off these notifications? No, I don't want ad notifications. They're just really bothersome on Twitch. Okay, there we go. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, no, it, episode 20, we're, right now we're in our training arc with uh, Mr. Stripes, hats, like Mr. Hat and Clogs. So, uh, yeah, training arc, and then we go into the Soul Society after that. You have an intense urge to watch Buffy this weekend. That is extremely based. <laughs> Love that. <clears throat> Pet the long cat. Oh yeah. The, the lawn cats are actually just right over here. They're watching the snowfall because there is... I wouldn't call it a storm, but it's gonna snow all day. Uh, and there's just gonna be more and more snow accumulation as the stream goes today. And now the Buffy opening a song is stuck in your head. Good! Buffy is amazing. That's not a bad one to have stuck in your head. But yeah, gosh, Buffy is great. I'm glad I got to rewatch Buffy with Dom. Because he really ended up loving it. As everybody should, it's an amazing show. 
been raining all day, so it's too warm where you're living at. Yeah, we have snow, and I was... I'm really upset about it, because I thought in Philadelphia I could escape snow a little bit. I know it snows here, but not near as much as up north, so... Yeah, it's gonna snow all day. I don't know how many inches of snow we'll get, but... Mm. It just, like, it scares me, because nobody around here actually puts winter tires on their car. Which is so dumb to me. This is why I don't want to drive out there, because everybody else's car just doesn't feel safe. Like, I'm scared of everybody else on the fucking road. It just doesn't make any sense to me why people don't put winter tires on here. Like, it snows, why aren't you doing it? Like, you're just making everybody else super unsafe. You had a heavy blizzard here yesterday. I had to use all of my legs today to get through the town. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, it's really scary. Like, I, I don't want to drive back to Canada without the roads being cleared and no snow. So I will literally stay here in Philadelphia as long as I need to. As long as, like, the roads are safe to go back. Because, yeah, people here are so dumb. And you know what? I never realized that growing up in Pittsburgh, too. A lot of people living in Pittsburgh also don't put on winter tires. They just use all-purpose tires and think that that can get them places in a lot of snow. Like, what are you doing? It's a coin toss if we get snow, but we definitely get ice. That's what winter tires are for! It makes me so infuriated because like if you don't put winter tires on and you have and you live in a place that can get snow it's like why put your life in danger and everybody else's life in danger i find it to be a very selfish thing just just get the winter tires Ooh. we were um i don't think i said this story but whenever we were driving down here uh, two weeks ago, whenever we initially drove down to Philadelphia, on the road, like, it started snowing. And we were driving... I don't remember if it was... It, uh, I don't remember what road it was. But there was literally, like, a, a little bit of powder of snow on the ground. And we're driving past this... We're, like... No, I should say the story in, like, chronological order here. So Dom and I are driving on a, like, a very thin powder layer of snow on the, on the, on the road. And we start to see these tire tracks that are, like, everywhere. And we're like, dude, what is up with some, like, it looked like someone was changing lanes and, like, they couldn't decide what lane they wanted to be in. So we're like, oh, what's going on? Like, why are these tire tracks, like, really weird? We catch up to the car in question. And they're just sliding around the road. And I was amazed. This car looked like a sports car that just had, like, the absolute worst tires I've ever seen. Like, how are you sliding this much on the road whenever it is just, just like, it's a dusting of snow. It is literally a dusting. It is not coated in snow whatsoever. It is a dust. I've never seen a car slide that bad over literally no snow. I don't even know if that car was able to make it home because it was really bad. The incline was like a very, very slight incline. Like very, very, very slight. With a fresh dust of snow and still couldn't make it. I'm like, dude, you are fucked. Like, you're actually just like an idiot. <clears throat> you have all-terrain tires on your car? Yeah, the thing is like... All-terrain tires, I don't think, really do anything. All-purpose tires, the same thing. It's like, it doesn't, doesn't, doesn't really do anything. <clears throat> Someone crashed outside your house this morning. That's scary. Anyway, so that's my story. Um, I get really frustrated with people in the snow and driving in snow that don't know how to drive in it nor take care of their car. <laughs> Hmm. My dad likes to joke that people forget where they live and that it fucking snows every year. I wish it was a law in certain areas, like New York, for example. Because, yeah, it, New York should definitely have the law. Or, like, in Canada, we have to have... It, it is a law to have your winter tires on your car before 
uh, I think, I think the first week of November, you have to have your winter tires on. And they do checks on the road. Like there are, there are police cars occasionally if you're driving in the winter. Uh, they will check your car to make sure that you have your winter tires on. Because like if you don't, you're just a detriment to everybody else on the road. Like it's just, it's just really not safe for everybody else. <clears throat> Maryland drivers in the winter, dude. I remember, um, what was it? I forget what year it was. It had to be like eight years ago at this point because it was when my sister was still living in her old apartment. And it was in Maryland. And you guys had this snow. I want to say it was like a foot of snow. You guys had a snowstorm. I don't think you've had a snowstorm since then. But I remember my sister said that like Maryland and Virginia shut down for like a whole week. Nobody went into work. Just nobody did anything. And it was over like a foot of snow, <laughs> which in Canada is like literally nothing. But it was really, really funny to witness how like people just cannot function. But it, I don't, I don't get it because it's not like you guys never get snow. It's, it's weird. It's weird to me. Like, better be safe than sorry kind of thing, because it's like, it's not like you guys never get snow, but you get it enough to be concerned about it. Yeah, snow is very pretty. Like, right now, me looking outside, it is very pretty outside. Very, very pretty. The snow is, like, falling nice, eh, mildly slowly. There's a little bit of wind, but not a lot. And it's just very, very white outside. <clears throat> I'd say it's more about, yeah, I'd say it's more about other people's safety um, whenever you don't, like, take care of your car. Because, like, typically you're going to be fine on the road. It's if other people are going to run into you is the real issue. Whenever I drive, I'm more scared of other people than I am of my own driving ability. <clears throat> it's really scary. Anyway. I should probably play video games. But anyway, yeah, the snow is actually really, really pretty outside, and it's been, uh... I'm hoping it doesn't accumulate too much. But it's pretty in there now, and I don't have to go outside, so that's also great. Hmm. <clears throat> Everyone loses 80% of their ability to drive when it's raining here. Dude, it's so funny. I will admit, I'm one of those people in rain, but that's because I have uh, some trauma with that, because I, I was in a car accident whenever it was heavily raining. So, yeah. Trauma. But I still drive. Like, I, 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 don't, I don't really slow down that much. Depends. If it's a really, really heavy rain, obviously, you have to. I mean, we could talk about the weather, sure, yeah. <clears throat> Good thing there's snow shoveling. It is one of the few physical activities that I do. I'm glad that snow makes you active. That is definitely a perk. <laughs> Hi, LTC. Hi, Julia. Hi, Zooblaze. Welcome, friends. All right, we're going to jump into the game now. Um... <laughs> So, now yeah, I did a little bit of farming, so this is where we're at right now, as an update. I got a chicken, I have a Norn, I have a Uh, we have that one from the last stream, and a oh, blep, I got blep, which blep is the highlight of my life, so I'm glad that we have blep. <clears throat> Blep has returned. Very happy about that. I also got all of the crack that was available to me in these free battles, which there was a lot of crack to get, so I got all those. Uh, I think we're gonna be okay for a while. I hope I don't run into any hiccups. That being said, let's just go. Hey, this is Sengakuji, right? Another Deva must be waiting beyond here. 
I'm sensing something odd. Be careful. They may be up to something. Blep is only one letter slop away from a being a bell. <laughs> God. Then he would be Belp. Mm. Belp. I am the guardian of the South Zochow. Mm. Zhao Chow. I ask of you, are you the ones who defeated Pishimon? That's right. Mm. Mm. I cannot forgive you. This idle banter is pointless. Your <laughs> death will lay the foundation of the demon realm. Have I ever mentioned how much I love Naoya? Mm. The four devas are not so foolish as to challenge Bishamon slayers alone. A pincer attack, huh? What a bunch of chickens. You're no better than a sewer rat, Komoku. <laughs> I could s I owe you my gratitude, though. You've saved us the trouble of finding you. I won't send you back alive. Prepare yourselves. I love him. I love him. Force repel. Yes. Oh, let's make now you get it, I think. Nalia is going south. That means maybe Mari goes south? No, that's not really that smart. Honestly, I don't I don't think it matters much. It's gonna be Kaido and no. Okay, I'm going with my brother. I, I lied. Um, <laughs> God damn it. Okay, no, I have to go north. I'm going north. And then Mari is gonna go with me. Kaido and Nalia are gonna go south. All right, let's beat up the four Dark Devas of Destruction. Huh. You add some letter to Belp and then you, and then it's Belpagor. Oh God, <laughs> that's a lot of added letters. Man, I sure hope I don't die. Would be a shame if we did. Just gonna come a little bit closer. That was like barely any zoom. My camera is broken, man. I need a new one. No! Oh come on! I just got lagged. Son of a fuck. Tion, hi. A lot of diarrhea. <clears throat> There's a good chance that I die here. Oh, never mind. Okay, I 
Okay, wow. Norn is a little bit more powerful than I thought. And I just got prayer, so that's pretty OP. Bluff. I love bluff. Norn is kind of great. We're probably going to have Norn for quite a bit here. If not all the way to the end game, I'm not sure. But there's a good chance of it. Blep, no! Oh, wait. Never mind. No! I need... Okay. You get more experience if you kill the other ones now, yeah? Piece of shit. Good for nothing. Fuck. Whenever you sneeze, we will reply with blep ya. <laughs> That's cute. Wait, I like that. That's actually adorable. Yes, I approve. Should I just attack this guy? Or let him come to me. Oh, he has evil wave. I, I should kill the evil wave so that he can't defeat me from a distance. Yeah, kill the Kale Kale Cool Bray. Oh, that's much better. If I can get also get rid of the Rangda, this is an amazing guy. And we immobilize the Deva. Oh my god, this is a fantastic day. Look at this. Freyrin today? I've never heard of that anime. What's it about? I bluff you in the name of our Lord RNG. Oh my god. That sounds like such a nice little prayer. Freyrin is awesome. I've never heard of this. Is this like a new anime? Because uh, yeah, I'm not very, I'm not very caught up with like new things. I'm a boomer. Starts with an elven mage and her party defeating a demon lord. Very Lord of the Rings. Oh. It's new. Okay, I've never heard of this. Maybe I'll start watching it after uh, we are... I'm done uh, um, with Bleach, which maybe never, but... I'm re-watching Bleach now. I gotta commit. I'm, I'm assuming since it's new, there's probably not a dub, though. Because I, I am a dub watcher for time reasons. <clears throat> There's a dub? Oh shit. Now we're talking. That sounds so cute. Okay, I'll have to I'll have to add it to my list. Freyrim. How many seasons are out right now? Just one season? Okay. Got it. Is it based off of like a, a light novel or a manga? Based on a manga. Okay, figures. Gotcha. Alright, I'll add it to my list. I gotta get rid of that evil wave. Look 
Kate, no. Mari, no. Oh my god. And he goes again because he's a Deva. Somehow I survived. Somehow we survived that. Okay, I'm gonna turn around and fuck this guy up. I just wanna get rid of uh, uh Agares is annoying with the drain. I do have Pierce for that, so I'm gonna I'm gonna punch. Actually, we're just gonna do Deathbound. <laughs> Actually. What if he gets Tetracarn out first, though? That could potentially be a very big problem. Oh my god! Of fucking course. You know what? I think I died serving a good cause here. That was that was a good death. Whoa! Hey! I have no regrets. Uh, Delicious in Dungeon on Netflix. Delicious in Dungeon. Okay. Oh my gosh, what is... <laughs> what is the name? <laughs> I don't understand. Is it worth... Um, Kaido is gonna die, but that's okay. I also am, I also do want to watch Jujutsu Kaisen, even though Shonen whatever crap. But like, I will, I do want to watch at least the first season. I'll feel better if I can at least watch the first season. Oh wait, he can just go to town. Oh wait, I don't have has I don't have enough HP, goddammit. Oh, so close. I just wanted to get rid of the cool braze. The cool bros. I much prefer the similar anime Campfire Cooking in another world with my absurd skill. What is this title? Campfire cooking in another world with my absurd skill. What the hell? If, if only I was stronger. Get good, scrub. There's a D&D party cooking monsters. Okay, party cooking monsters. Okay, okay got it. <laughs> this is so cool. Okay. I guess I should bring in. Don't kill Blep. Oh yeah, the extremely long titles. That's a staple. That's just that's just a thing. <laughs> I guess I should heal. I could be potentially in danger. I already have two people down. I do have Samari Karn, so I wasn't too concerned, but it's it still can be a problem. Do you think Devil Survivor 3 is possible? I'm gonna say no. I don't take pleasure in saying that, but yeah, I don't think so. I can stay hopeful for you guys, absolutely, though. I 
I don't want to kill him because don't I? Uh, doesn't something trigger if you kill one? And we're kind of not in a good state right now. <laughs> know if it'll be like so hard for you know I wouldn't I wouldn't say that I think that's a bit of a stretch I killed the kill with the cool bro, cool bro, kill bro, kill, cool, cool, cool bro. Holy damage! Dude got fucked in the ass. Shit. Do I give Norn? What do I give Norn? Samari Karm? Or holy dance? Maybe holy dance. But drain is also important. At least we do have, um, we will have mana aid eventually, so I'll just do holy dance. Hmm. <clears throat> Ascending is one that I'm looking for. For Isekai, it's one of the greats that is quite overlooked. Oh, I'd, I'd have to look into that. Ascendance. Ascendance. I'm not like crazy into Isekais, but um, if there's a good one out there, I'll watch it. Oh, we gotta raise Kaido, don't we? He's like still dead. <laughs> Almost forgot about this boy. I killed one. Love that. Why do they always kill Lakshmi? <laughs> well, Lakshmi's always the first to die. Oh no, Dual Shadow actually procced. Oh, I needed that too. They're just gonna fucking heal. Ranga. <clears throat> Alice in Wonderland is an isekai. It definitely is. No, I never really liked Alice in Wonderland. It was never, I don't know, it was just never my kind of thing. Vampire. 
It feels really weird to me, gosh. I feel- I really feel like I'm so out of touch with, like, anime lately. Um... Because I, I, I don't know any new animes that comes out anymore. Like, all of my anime knowledge is, like, five years plus old. Even more than that, probably. Because I really stopped keeping up with, like, new shows a while ago. So any new good animes in the past, like, five years, I really just don't know anything about. So whenever you guys name an anime, it's really weird to me. Because, like, five years ago, I knew, like, every anime. But now, I don't know anything. <laughs> so... Like, Nichijo, okay, I'm pretty sure I've heard that name before somewhere, but I'm like, yeah, I don't really know it. You're just watching Freyrin. The only thing I actively keep up with is pretty much, like, maybe Spy Family. I think I- I don't know if I'm dropping My Hero Academia or not. I think I watched up to, like, season 3 or 4. Jujutsu Kaisen got me back into anime? I doubt it would, because, like, I'm not, um, I don't know. I don't know how done I am with shonen type stuff. But I'm sure I'm still gonna like Jujutsu Kaisen, like, absolutely. My experience! He fell off of it hard. Yeah, my hero got really, um, disappointing. <laughs> for sure. That's all for Davis. So now the demon world and human world will be connected? Nothing's happening. What's the deal? <laughs> patience, patience. The demon world will be here soon enough. <laughs> now yeah, chill is all hell. All right, where is it coming? Look, the point of connection has already begun to show itself. Huh. He's like, oh, look, it's just right there. The, the demon world's past that thing? <laughs> Looks to me like it's around Rapongi somewhere. Indeed, the highest floor of the Hills building is where the server used to be. Since Babel and server are one, it's only natural for it to appear there. No other place is as suited to summoning Babel. All right, we're going in. Be prepared. The other demons of the War of Bell will be waiting for us. Gah, what a pain in the ass. How many of these Bell demons they got left? It's hard to say exactly, but there are two we'll definitely have to face. Belbereth who used the Shomonkai and organized this war for the throne, and Belzebul, equal to Belbereth in power, yet lending him his strength. Those two will certainly serve as obstacles in our path. Belbereth will have taken a position in the server room so he could be closest to Babel. Oh, I've heard of Vinland Saga. And he'll most certainly send Belzebul after us. We must proceed very carefully. That final trial thing? <laughs> I don't know who the hell it thinks it is. But we just gotta beat the last bell guys and crush Babel. Then the world will be ours. <laughs> Demons may not be the only enemy. Don't forget who ordered this lockdown. They're on the list. You got that right. Once you become Overlord, we'll go up against God. Of course but the angels will try to prevent that from ever happening. No kidding. Are these angels that strong? Nah. <laughs> Scared? A little reluctant to fight against God after- <laughs> Hell no! Right, Nerdlinger? <laughs> Nerdlinger. Honestly, I don't know. I admit, I still have doubts. <laughs> then I'll tell you a story to erase those doubts. Oh! In various religions story and time. war, God is said to be an absolute being. Complete in every way. But how true is that? Is God really a complete entity? Well? Exactly. If God were truly absolute, then his creation would never falter. 
But humans do become corrupt, and demons do exist. Proof that he is flawed too. Do you see? God isn't absolute. Ooh. When his creations don't obey his will, he eliminates them. Wait, I actually really like that line. I had literally never thought of that. Demons exist because God is flawed. Huh. That is a very interesting thought. The same goes for the angels, since they too were created by the same God. Wow. That's banger. He doesn't save those who believe in him. He crushes those who don't. Exactly. God's mercy is saved for his followers. That is his way. That is his absolute just. And angels are his messengers. Little more than the embodiment of his wrath. Remember, we wouldn't be stuck in this situation had they not agitated the lockdown. That's right. They didn't want to let anybody out of this lockdown from the get-go. And the only thing for us to do is to crush them. But we're really running low on time if we're going to fight the angels and the bells. <laughs> Let's ask the government. We'll have to negotiate with the government. Let's get in touch with Azuna and her boss. Stupid. I know we have to push the lockdown time. Hmm. If there's a good chance of getting more time, it's worth the trip. Yo, better think about what you're gonna say. You can't tell him, I'm gonna become Overlord, but I need some more time. <laughs> Why not? Maybe even then they'd have to accept our demands. It's time we had a parley. Oh, great. You kids. Yeah, Demon Slayer I found to be very mid. I don't think Demon Slayer is that great. The art is beautiful. It's some of like the best animation I've ever seen. I'll give it that. But yeah, I just find it incredibly mid. Commander Fushimi? Sure, give me a moment. Sorry to make you wait. What did you want to tell me? Should I make Nalia do it? No, I'm gonna do it. Hmm. I'll take that. Ah, damn me. it! Nalia! Hmm. Who are you? I'm Nalia. Surely you've heard of me while investigating the Shomonkai. How could I forget that name? The man who designed the demon summoning program. The one who got us into this situation. I've wanted to meet you face to face. <laughs> Don't get emotional. What have I done, really? The Shomonkai summoned the demons, and the government started the lockdown. You bastard. How many lives do you think were lost because of you? Enough. I don't have time for your questions, government lapdog. <laughs> we're heading for the server to make him the king of demons. You'll assist us. What? The King of Demons? Don't be absurd. Why would we ever help you with that? No? Well, it's your loss. Resist all you want, but if you really wanted to save the people of Tokyo, you'd cooperate with us. What? Use your brain for once. He will become Overlord. Should he order it, demons will cease their attack on humans. The threat will disappear. Oh my god. Fortunately, he's kind-hearted. He wouldn't order demons to attack humans. Well, is this so different from what you all hope for? Holy shit, now he is a terrifying person. A human becoming the king of demons? You expect us to believe such an absurd story? I do trust you, but this is just too... So you trust the angels? I'd think twice about taking their word over ours. You see, they know that your mission is ultimately futile. What do you mean by that? Answer me, damn you! 
There are two reasons. First, surely you know this final option has no chance of exterminating the demons. Wh what? Man could deplete his entire arsenal and still fail to kill every last one. Yes, if the final option goes through, the comps and all their users will die. But demons are different. With their tamers gone, they will attack the outside world. The government can use the final option, but the spread of demons can't be stopped. But if that's true... Second, we've already <laughs> opened a portal to the demon world. You can see it over Ropongi. If we die, this world will be swallowed into the demon world in a matter of days. And if that happens... In this a matter of days, finished. he says. It's the, literally the last day. This can't be. How is this happening? <laughs> Angels truly honor free will, don't they? They won't tell you a single thing you could puzzle out for yourself. Remember, I'm the creator of a demon summoning program. No one knows more about their kind than myself. Dude, now you're as metal as fuck. So once again, whatever the angels tell you, the final option has no meaning. Demons will continue to spread. This world will end. And the angels, they'll do nothing. Oh my God. <laughs> Our preparations are complete. It's a matter of time before he becomes overlord. However, everything will be for naught if the final option is used. So you want us to extend the deadline? You're catching on faster now. That's correct. It's not my call. There's a commander outside the lockdown. <laughs> I don't expect that much from you. It doesn't matter how you do it. As long as you get it extended, that's enough. Thousands of lives can be saved. I'm not driving such a hard bargain, am I? Holy shit, dude. <laughs> Think it over. You don't have to abort the mission. Just buy us some time. That's all. I... I can't promise anything. <laughs> sure. But don't forget, everything in this world depends on you. We'll be off for Ropongi now, having a second to lose. Ha! You had the army eaten right out of your hand! What? I only told them the truth. It was a frank and honest negotiation. Holy shit. That was no negotiation, bro. <laughs> they painted themselves into a corner. Such gross incompetence is a sin. Oh my god. <laughs> you got that right. <laughs> oh, shit. Now, even if it puts his position in jeopardy, he'll get the deadline extended. Jeez. I'd hate to have you for an enemy now, yeah? Mm-hmm. But was that true? Killing all the people in here won't stop the demons from spreading? Oh yes, it was true enough. Not the whole truth, but I told him no lies. But no harm, no foul. The angels used force to coerce this lockdown, after all. True. True. Every side plays dirty to get what it wants. Now that the government knows the angels of absolute justice aren't on their side, their judgment will suffer in a cascade of useless meetings. The red tape will buy us time. Gotcha. In the meantime, we reach Babel and make him overlord. I'm glad to see you're so quick on the uptake. All right, let's hurry to Rapongi. Yes. Just because the negotiation succeeded doesn't mean we have time to spare. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm about ready to cut loose. Holy shit. I can't get over how metal as fuck now he is. He's such a great character. Oh. Zocho is all the way back here. And then Komoku is up here. Oh boy. <laughs> Oh my god. As Medea saw Tanazu suffering, now that you be kind of scared. <laughs> Thank you, Beth B, for the 666. I appreciate that. God.
me getting a heart attack every time. Without fail. I never know how, how high to go. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm interested to see the Desu 2 anime adaptation. Is that something that we watch in Discord together? watch party even if it's bad what dude you shelled out so much money The manga. The, the manga goes hard. If I ever have the time. <laughs> I would love to! Alright, let's just keep going. Now, we'll go to the topmost floor of this building and access Babel. <sighs> First, we've got company to deal with. <laughs> but yeah, it's Bob. showed up. So this is Belzebul. Yeah, <laughs> I'll give you your final duty. Die here. <laughs> Dude. Hell yeah. Fucking hell, dude. Alright, Meteor Hand Prayer. Are we gonna be able to get it? Norn's like way over yonder. Uh, I have Devil Speed. I think the only person that would be able to get it is Naoya. I'm gonna try. I have Flight. So Meteor Hand is also. Oh, Lakshmi. Try to get it. Jesus! We are sad about. What's that sound? Oh, it's flies. <laughs> I can't believe I'm like here in flies. That's crazy. Where is it coming from? Are you guys hearing the flies too? Or is it just me? They're everywhere? Yeah. Okay. So I'm not going too crazy here. So Ari. Yeah, we're we're probably not gonna get all this crack because at some point they turn into flies. <clears throat> I need uh I'm sorry, Lakshmi. I know you're great, but I do need Phantasma.
Oh yeah. What's uh Bub's range? Okay. Just wanna stay out of range for right now. The other girls left Protag, but Mari is super cool with Protag, becoming Demon King. Oh, of course. Yuzu and Midori, they're too young to understand. Small brain, too young. All right, Blep, let's go. No. Hmm. What to do? Kill Blep. Ha, killed yourself, bitch. Hey, insert. Yes, come to me, come to me. I think this is worth it. Never getting anywhere. Dude, it is so light outside. There's so much snow. Nothing is dead. Elbereth must become king of Bell, now die. No. Oh, wait. Bitch. So, I need Lakshmi's crack, though. And now Lakshmi is very far away. Oh boy! 
This is awful. This is literally awful. Yes, I have Kaido with a uh, Hasapampa. Wait, no, no, all this crack is backwards. You fucker. kill the others, I just don't want to kill Norn on accident. That's fine. Oh god. I really want my crack, please don't kill me. Good thing my chicken has endure. This is gonna be a bitch. dead are we? You're doing great, Kaido. There! Okay, your reflect actually killed something. That's cool. Oh my god! What the heck? Wait, where... so weird. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> it's time to start shuffling. Oh, thank you so much. Genu Wait, genuinely crabby. What the hell? Thank you for gifting 10 subs, dude. I really appreciate that. That was... <laughs> I don't know why it froze. I wonder if my computer is just straight dying. Dude, no, this cannot be happening. I'm- I'm- I'm cornered in. I need my crack and it's over there and I can't get over there! This is ass! I know, that was a lot. Thank you, genuinely Krabby, that's a lot of support though. Thank you so much. All right, I can move out of the way here to Lakshmi. I can go get my uh, crack. Unfortunately, we're gonna lose Kaido's crack, but that's not really that important in comparison to Meteora Ham. So, it's gonna be fine. How dead are we? Like, I have nothing. I, I don't have a heal. This was not very intelligent of me. scale of fucked to fucked.
All right, I'm gonna try to get my Oreo crack here. This is ass, I make you say it often, I'm so sorry. I'm really not a good influence. No. Good thing I just got Holy Dance though. Oh boy, we need a lot more output than that, buddy. I feel like it's better I just like keep people alive. Why do Spriggans have so much health? Hello! Kaido's gonna be here forever, y'all. I guess we should just go for the kill. I shouldn't just linger here and try to kill Agaris. I should just go for, go for the bang here. All right, give me prayer. I feel like I don't need to go that hard on Morn. You were uploading a video and my internet hates when I do that. Yeah, oh, I'm so sorry. Magnetite. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ringa has to pop up. Or like Duck Bound instead. Hmm. A random Samari Karm. I now have Prayer though, which is amazing. We are now yanging. <laughs> That's a verb, yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No! My crack! Now I gotta deal with fleas? Mm -hmm. Oh boy. I don't think I need to heal. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was unexpected. I'm a flea. I'm sure this will go fine. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Look at all these little shits. And I'm a fly. And I am also a fly. And now you are a bunch of dead flies. Congratulations.
I am now no longer a fly. All right, time to beat up. And one go. Watch it not happen. <laughs> you think a human bell stands a chance against me? You talk big for a bug. <laughs> Flies are terrifying creatures, you'll understand in time. That's a lot of damage. I need to do more of that damage. My health is in danger. That's a holy shit. Disgusting. Vermin certainly multiply quickly. Oh, I never got to that part of this fight because I killed it way too fast. So I never saw that in the first time I did this. <laughs> That's disgusting. And then they multiply. They do damage and they multiply. That's gross. This unintelligent bastard doesn't know how to do anything besides lay eggs. Yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Is prayer even worth it, honestly? Just kill the fox. Just kill him. get the kill, I guess? Or do we go for more experience? We'll just defeat all the flies. Yeah, just defeat all the flies. So whenever they multiply, it's only one fly, so it's not as bad. And then I have... Affection? So you no longer have flies, but Mari has flies. Oh, wait, I'm dying. I could have used affection. It's okay. I don't need, I don't need affection. Holy fuck. Bellworth has already taken in more bells than you and your power spouse is mine. We make it to Babel. These are the same ones as before. I literally took like a giant fly swatter and was like, Whoosh. 
Belzebul, once hailed as the Duke of Hell, was known to possess immense power. After defeating him and absorbing his power, you should be much stronger. I think you're right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good sign. Embrace the power dormant in you. Only Belbereth remains, the god who made a pact with the Shomonkai's founder and started this War of Bell. Yo, this founder is just an ordinary guy, right? Why'd this Belbereth thing lend him its power? From what I know, the founder genuinely intended to save people. He knew God's ordeal was close, and mankind, drunk on its own technology, wouldn't survive. He wasn't altogether wrong. Modern man has indeed overindulged in peace. He wanted to save us from God's ordeal, huh? huh I'm not sure we needed his saving. If he hadn't summoned that demon, God might have never given us this ordeal. Oh, believe me, the ordeal would have come regardless. That's how God is. Got a grudge? Hmm. The subject under discussion <laughs> is Belbereth. He didn't respond to that. Now you straight up ignored that. As I said before, his goal is the original power of Bell, dormant within Babel. The original Bell that lost its struggle against God was split into multiple Bells. Of which, Belbereth is the most dominant, <laughs> the embodiment of the original Bell. So you hate God. So about Bell! His hunger for revenge against God is strongest, and so is his craving for his old power. It was a perfect match for the Shomonkai founder wanting to resist God's ordeal. Both he and Belbereth had a score to settle with God. I see. So Belbereth was the one who started the war for the throne of Bell? It must have absorbed a lot more Bells by now. Won't it be pretty strong? Belbereth seems to have beaten the Bells in its world, as well as other nearby worlds. As Atsuro has guessed, it must have amassed a considerable amount of power. I have my own powers. That's right. You've obtained the powers of Belder, Belial, Jezebel, Be and Belzebul oh thus far. I miss Belial. And if we can drag Belbereth into our world, he won't be able to use his full strength. If we can't win under those conditions, then he simply can't be beaten. Don't sweat the small stuff. You got us with you, you know? I don't need you. All you got to think about is how that throne's going to feel sitting on it. There you are. Huh? Oh, Commander. I've reached a settlement with the top brass. They're willing to give you two more hours. If you can settle everything by then, I made them promise to lift the lockdown. That's great. Thank you so much. Two hours should be more than enough. This is the most I could do. I'm begging you. Save Tokyo for us. Good luck. Two hours, eh? That should suffice. But once we start, we won't have time to turn back. Get ready now. So you'll be prepared for any eventuality. The snow trucks are just a human outside. I think I just saved my game, but I don't remember, so I'm doing it again. I did just save my game. Holy shit. Ah, oh, we're taking the stairs? My legs sure are gonna be sore tomorrow. If there is a tomorrow. Oh, haha. <laughs> you, uh... Didn't have to remind me. You're acting more and more like now, you. You know that? Did you say something, Atsuro? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, nothing at all. Nothing at all. Hmm. We don't have time to waste, so move it. <laughs> now we go. Oh. Oh. oh, this is a oh. new fight. We have to fight the angels now. They're pissed. Hmm. Serial and Anael, eh? Anal. How loyal of you to come and destroy us personally. <laughs> it's 
seems the angels are getting rather desperate themselves. Oh. 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 We ask of you, will you be God's messenger and lead mankind? Oh. If he who holds Bell's power kneels before God, the angels will acknowledge his kingship. Oh. Oh. Aid God in bringing light and order to this world, and we swear to lift this lockdown. Oh. Answer me, as king, will you shine or sink into eternal darkness? I embrace darkness. <laughs> Too bad, angels. He is my brother. He isn't so foolish as to be deceived by your sweet talk. Man won't be free in the life you and God see as ideal. What would be the point of living? We humans declare right now to fight to stay human. We won't yield to God's threats. Shit. Oh. Oh. Your deceitful words only mask your hidden agenda, sinner. God is truly saddened. <laughs> he can cry all he wants. I don't give a damn about an unjust God's crocodile tears. Well, I think we're officially brothers right now because it's Cain and Abel, which is cool. Oh. Have you truly lost your soul's memory and been reduced to a mere human? My soul's memory. Oh. Abel was born as a child of God. That memory is yours now and should rest within you. Yeah, I am a bell. <sighs> Don't listen to a word he says. He's only trying to confuse you. Oh. Foolish Abel, the man you follow now once robbed you of your life. That's how Cain Seriously, and Abel works. what a pain in the ass. Would you just shut up and bring it on? <laughs> Your words are falling on deaf ears, angels. Now step aside. That is the story of uh, Cain and Abel. So if I recall in the story of Cain and Abel, um, one kills the other, right? So does that mean at the end of this we gotta fight Noah and we gotta kill him? Because I'll be really sad if that's true. We gotta kill Naoya as per Cain and Abel tradition. <laughs> Which is really sad. Cain killed Abel over jealousy. Yeah, I couldn't remember which brother killed which. Uh, yeah. I, I vaguely know the Cain and Abel story, but yeah. So, yeah. Uh -huh. That's fun. He'll try to kill me, but uh, I will beat up Cain instead, so. You trust Nalia? After everything that Nalia's said and done? Nah, he's just using me. That's what Cain and Abel do. <laughs> he's definitely just using me. Okay. Physical amp, fire dream. Dude, anal looks terrible. Yeah, and then I, if I recall, so like, I couldn't remember which brother killed what until I remember. There's like, there's like a, a mark of Cain kind of thing that happened. Is it because God was mad? So like, Cain kills Abel, 
and then God gives him some sort of like mark of pain, so he's like cursed forever, if I recall. Poor Nalia. <laughs> he's gotta live like this. <laughs> Yeah, okay, I, hey, I remembered something. I don't remember where I learned the Cain and Abel story. Was it Supernatural? No, I learned it before Supernatural. I actually might have learned it in Sunday, like, church school. I think I actually learned it there and I remembered it, which is amazing. I learned something in my Sunday Catholic school. <laughs> and then I remember it being reinforced when I watched Supernatural, which was around the same time when I was a kid. Yeah. <laughs> You definitely want to learn in church, yeah. Yeah, my family's big Catholic, so my uh, my Sunday school, I think, I think taught me that. Cain was a farmer. Oh, I don't remember there being farmers. Wow, I don't remember that part. I thought they were knights. My bad. Okay. So as I told you, it was supposed to be a blood sacrifice after the offering for giving. Cain killed his brother and was punished to the until his experience has all life has to offer. 500 year old Jesus Christ. This story has metal as fuck. I thought that they were knights. I don't know. I don't know where that comes from. I, I have no explanation for that, okay? I don't recall them being farmers. <laughs> The knights might be Fire Emblem. Wait, you're right. It's Shadow Dragon. Cain and Abel are in Shadow Dragon. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's that's uh, that's really embarrassing. <laughs> that's why I remember them being knights. They're they're literally paladins. Well, cavaliers. They're cavaliers. Anyway, um. I'm gonna move on. Bro, okay, this is all like my childhood, okay? I haven't heard the Cain and Abel story probably since Supernatural, whenever I watched it like two decades ago. I swear it's been that long. I have uh, <laughs> no other explanation. You're in the way back. That's a little annoying. Effie doesn't even teach that story. Cain and Abel were like nice brothers. I don't think they killed each other. Like, I don't think Cain killed Abel. It, literally just the names, but not the story at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's, that's, that's really silly. <laughs> oh. God sees all. Also, God, how could this happen? How could this happen? This was not ordained. So this is Kaido, this is me, okay. And I can't jump over that, which is a little bit shit, but whatever, we're not gonna talk about it. Um, and then uh, way back in this corner is Nalia, which is a little unfortunate. I could make it closer. I just kind of hate myself, you know, that's, that's for evil. Uh. 
<laughs> Hello, Niper. Welcome to the stream. I feel like I have to edit my team, but like, I, I got nothing to edit. I'm satisfied with my demons, so we just keep going. Oh. oh, Abel, come to your senses. It's not too late. Obey us at, as an agent of God. I know what I'm doing. Oh. oh, you must use the King of Bell's power to assert order for humanity and justice for God. <laughs> now you're trying to work the power of Bell into your selfish little deal? <laughs> I see you've inherited God's way of stealing all the credit for himself. Oh. oh, Cain, who despite being God's child carried out the first murder, you should die. I love these voices. They're great. Should I be concerned? No. There's only Makar Karn. And once again, ladies and gentlemen, Lakshmi is dead! Can I get a woo? This is quite a shocker, if I do say so myself. It's almost like I didn't see it coming. Oh wow, that was a quick, holy shit, that was a lot of experience. Oh, hey, guess who's dead? Guess who can't get Magnetite? Well, um, I think I'd rather have Holy Dance than Megiddo, to be honest. But I also could replace this fish. Uh, so we're gonna do that. Do I want Frere or another Samaric Arm? I think I want... Rare. Because I could use a heal right now. Mari, don't suck. Oh, have a good one, Zooplace. Thank you so much for chilling. Appreciate it. That's a lot of damage. Man, angels sure do love casting their judgment. That guy! Piece of shit. Four? Four? You can't do any better than that? Okay. And Norn doesn't get any of that experience. Man, that is sad. I need mana aid. <laughs> Go sick his ass. Blep. Oh, 
and dual shadow. Blep, what was that? What was that, Blep? Can't do any better than that, buddy. Holy shit, that experience. It's kind of busted. Oh, prayer will get rid of my status. now. So we Oh my god. The, the experience coming out of this fight is really, really hot. Colin D. Colin D, President of Pudding. Thank you for the five months. I really appreciate that. I hope you're enjoying your pudding adventures in life. I feel like I should just use whole ingredients. Blep's stats are pretty much the same. I want my experience, bitch. No! Oh my god, I thought they okay. I just I just wanted them all dead. Cause I'm getting a fuck ton of experience. Hell yeah. Alright, so this guy's on his way. And this guy is now just crack. Good luck with that. President of putting D's. In oh my god. I don't know what to say to that. That's some nice damage. That's up some not, not so nice damage. And that sucks ass. It's okay, we didn't need that guy. Angels don't need affection. What is this bullshit? Hmm. I 
do... Uh, oh, wait, I do have affection. Wait, Kaido needs affection. I'll give you affection, but nobody else. Alright, the real question is... Is Lakshmi gonna die? Put your bets in now, everybody. Oh. Maybe Lakshmi's not gonna die for once. didn't die. What is that? Purging light? Oh, you're purging my MP? Oh. That's not really that threatening, but okay. That's okay. Whatever. Whole 55. We're going places. Hey, can you hear me? Oh, I can almost make it across. Hmm. Not quite there. broke as a Dedricard and then got rid of his own Dedricard. I thought it was great. I mean, I didn't have to do anything. Stop healing, you pussy! Did anybody die? Oh, I thought somebody died. I was so ready to heal, man. That's a lot more MP. What the shit?
Okay, I said now you can't get around this fat ass, and now you can now get around this fat ass. Actually, no, drain the barong. Fuck that guy in particular. Recarm, Recarm, Smarkarm, Scare Cam, Hoochie Lane, Choo Choo Train. I like that. I know I say pretty much every one of the demons wrong, uh, and I just don't care. Chris Hype. Punch! Thank you for the 14 month of resub. I appreciate that. I hope that you are enjoying your emotes and, uh, yeah, and, and, and no ads. That's definitely a vibe. Alright, I don't want Maziodon. You think I want that shit? No. No, I do not. Alright, let's kill some things. Chris is God! Thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. I hope you have a good one. Drain the anal. That sounds weird. I am missing so much. This is not what I imagined angels to look like. It's a little weird. They look like zombies. That's gonna hurt. Huh, that works. Astaroth is the only one that does damage. And that's because he has Pierce. <clears throat> Another fat purple dumpy. Y'all don't want to be a part of the Million Point Club? We only have two members of the Million Point Club in the Discord. It is a very top secret special club. Only 200k away. Oh, if I do an Elden Ring stream, I'm sure you'll uh, lose all of that. I'm very surprised that Lakshmi isn't dead, but this angel is like really weak. Anal. Anal is weak. You're only at 110k. If you gamble it enough times, you're gonna you'll be fine. Go get it real fast. I'm a really bad influence. <laughs> hey mom, I watched a stream today and streamer told me it was okay to gamble to be a part of a really cool club. Worry not, anal. I shall take it from here. Wow. gambled a lot in the RE streams. Th those were like the good gambling days, you know. I'm promoting gambling. I know, I should start streaming on kick. We're slowly getting there, guys. 
slowly in there. All right, we definitely got it this time. Kaido, you know, he's trying his best. Oh, he got rid of his own technique farm. What a fucking idiot. Hey, he's finally dead. want I think I'd rather have deathbound Love all the leveling. Makes me feel good. Huh. Finally, we've cleared out the small fry. Freaking angels, making us waste our time like that. Let's hurry ahead. Yeah. Hmm. We're really on God's bad side now, huh? <laughs> yeah. We fought the angels yesterday and now again today. There's no excusing that. The kingdom of God is ruled by absolute order and justice. No exceptions. But it's difficult for a man to go from cradle to grave committing no sins, is it not? Oh. <laughs> In God's eyes, all humans are sinners and must therefore be punished. There's no mercy. I know. I don't want a world like that. There's no need to fear God or to kiss his ass. <laughs> We're all we need. God is irrelevant. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, should be no problem. Yeah. We humans are trying as hard as we can. If a god ordered this lockdown, then to hell with it. Man, you guys think too much. We want power, we want the world. So we fight, yeah? Those angels, though. Oh, they got some nerve. Asking us to join them. He has the potential to become overlord. They crave that power. The potential. Gotta say it right. The Overlord is a master of demons. If he were to bow his head before God, God's authority would increase, and some of the strength in the demon world would be lost. The balance of power would be upset, Demon, which is why God wants to use him as his pawn once he becomes the King of Bell. Ugh, that cheap bastard. Looks like we gotta crush him once and for all. <laughs> well said. That's God's true nature. Selfish, contemptible scum. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, what's Abel? <laughs> That's right. I almost forgot about that. I wonder how Naoya responds. Does that have something to do with the Bell Demons too? They said something about betrayal and whatnot. Ask all you want, but I have nothing to say on the subject. <laughs> <laughs> Even if you knew, it has no relevance to our objective. Oh, bro. Naoya's gonna kill us in the end. We're running out of time. Let's depart as soon as we're ready. Dodge and left and right. Shh, 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 shh. It's all right. I still love him. I don't care. He can kill me. He can try to kill me. It's fine. I guess. Ooh. Look at these demons. Ooh. Ooh, Ooh la la. I'll take both of these, thank you.
<laughs> I love how Naoya responds to it. It's just such a sensitive, sore subject. You know, you just can't bring it up. You just can't talk about it. Don't talk about it. That's right, get fucked, Kata Kato Kura. Oh god, that's too much money. Please let me win. Oh my god. Fucking assholes. A lot of you. system was so much better in the second game. Fuck off. Assholes. So I can, oh, I can also buy a snake. Do I want to make this guy? Oh yeah, I can buy a berserker. I want a snake, but I also, uh, I think the preserver, yeah, he's all the way back here. I finally fused mine not long ago. Give me. Mishi. Accident. That's not my... Wait, that's the other one I failed, though, isn't it? I failed that one. So I ended up getting it in the end. That's pretty cool. Okay, do I make Kaz feel... I do like the chicken, though. And a lot of this is getting rid of my chicken. The chicken is in every one of these fusions. God damn it. Alright, goodbye, chicken. Flight was nice while it lasted. This guy is strength-based. I have nothing for that. Asshole.
chicken really does go with everything. Ha! <laughs> yes. I could have used, um, I could have fused the other guy, then he would have had Hasa Hapa. But, meh. At some point, I just got too lazy to care. Alright, Hikate is also, um, dying quite a lot at this point. So we could get Oreo. Oh boy. Oh. With Samari card that you can only use once because you don't have an MP pool, but it's fine. Don't worry about it. Ooh, Pierce, yes. Uh, endure. Null Curse would be nice so that you're not weak to it. But Dual Shadow. You know what I'm... What, what do I go for? Dual Shadow or Null the Curse? Because, like, he's weak to Curse, so that'd be nice. And zooms, but... <laughs> but Pierce, this fucking sucks. Alright, what did I lose? I lost my chicken. In favor of this piece of shit. I still have a Lakshmi that's gonna die all the time. I still have 5,000 pixies. Why am I here? <laughs> that's the real question. Why the fuck am I here? Just to suffer. Yeah, it feels like that. Alright, moving right along though. We're kind of plowing through these fights now, which is good. That is the idea. I do need to go get more water. So I will be right back. Y'all be better not be getting de dehydrated. Yeah, if you um, if you're dehydrated at all, you're banned from the stream. It's true. Alright, the founder. Oh, fuck that guy. Let's go. Now, should we start our climb? Once we do, there won't be time to turn back. I don't, yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Now. If we run out of time while going up, this was all for nothing. Now let's go. I'll take the path I believe in. Hopefully I can be of some use to you all. Honestly, Mari kind of dies a lot, but it's fine. Let's do it. Huh. It comes down to this. A lot's happened. But I appreciate what you've done. Let's go! This is it. Once this battle is over, you'll be Overlord. Wait, this can't be the end end. But I'm glad I could come this far with you. Come on! Oh, this feels weird. Emergency stairs. <sighs> ah, man, what the hell? How come the Overlord and his minions gotta take the stairs? Without electricity, we can hardly use the elevators. <laughs> Hasn't it been a constant problem? Phones, computers, TVs, even radios. Useless. Modern society depends on its conveniences. What happens when they're taken away? They'll go crazy. I can see why the founder of the Shomonkai was desperate to prevent God's ordeal. We're... Were our daily lives that fragile? I... I can't believe it. Hmm? Oh, 
We're at the highest floor. Wait, what on earth? This is the top floor of the Hills building? This stage. Something's weird. It's closed to the public. The Shomonkai rents this entire floor as their server room. No kidding? Man. Wait, they rent they it? Money hand over fist. They pay money? Hold up. Someone's here. Now ya! How dare you show your face here, you traitor! Oh boy. Those who hinder my glorious ideals. I won't let you use the demon's power for your own desires. You accusing me of betrayal is hilarious. I don't remember becoming one of you. Besides, you desire the power of the demons too, just like the rest of us. Me? <laughs> I'm different. I have only one desire. For the people to overcome God's ordeal and live on. That's all. Uh-huh. Do your preaching somewhere else. All you want is power. Admit it. You fools. I'll show you just how righteous my ideals are. Fools. <sighs> He's got something up his sleeve. Be careful. All of you gathered here. Heed my words. I have sounded the warning bell against the coming ordeal of God. And now I will forfeit my life to save mankind. Witness my ultimate sacrifice. I will invite Master Belbereth to this world, thereby overcoming God's ordeal. No one will stand in my way. Now, Master Belbereth, eat my flesh. My soul and my life descend upon our world. My price is only that you defeat God and bring about a world free of his ordeals. <laughs> All right. Oh, raging God, our majesty, Master Belbereth. So this is the same as before. Oh, it's Master Belvereth! Master Belvereth has descended! Oh, our God, Master Belvereth, we praise thee! <laughs> the founder disappeared. Where on earth did he go? He's dead. <laughs> he became my flesh and blood, not a bone remain. You think you're gonna be my lord? Don't make me laugh, you frickin' meatball. We will cut off the walkway leading to the altar. All right, I'll do it. You scum! You'll have to go through me if you want to harm Master Belvereth. You will feel the full force of our exalted Lord Belvereth's power! All I have desired is the power of Bell. I won't concern myself with what happens to the rest if I refuse. I will kill God, his children, his bloodline. I'll cut them into Senu. I will even rid of the demon realm of the great darkness that rules there. Praise me, fear me. A new world order is beginning. I'll pass. Insolent child of God, you have taken in the power of many bells. You have defeated Jezebel as well as Bezerba, Bezerba, both of whom are sent here by me. Despite being scum, your coming this far makes you more than disposable. But there is only one throne and only one of us will claim it. I will have your power. Sorry, but he will be the king of Bell. My decision on the matter is final. That's a lot of crack. Oh, ho, 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 ho. yes. Oh my god, multi strike. Let's fucking go. Okay, give me that. 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 All right, so Grace absolutely saved my ass last time.
If I get multi-strike, it's all over. I also want health save, but I can't have both health save and um, multi-strike. I can't crack both of them. So it's going to go to Kaido for now. So you get health save. Mari is going to get... Uh, it's actually better if Grace goes to now to you. And then Mari, you can have... Oh, you can't even take Debilitate. The thing is, Grace... Without Drain, Mari doesn't utilize it very well. Because she's just going to run out of MP eventually. And then you also have to debilitate. Oh god, okay. Uh, so yeah, no, let's... Okay, but Grace is going to go to Nalia. Mari, I don't think, can benefit from anything, really. Makarakar! No, I'm just kidding. I don't fucking know, dude. Alright, guess you're going over there. Um, let's actually take a look, because I, I do forget. Mr. Belberth. Okay, he's weak to wind, which is, uh, Mari's gonna murder his ass. Ufidine, Mazudine. So, ice and thunder skills. Uh, on a scale of dead to dead, I'm gonna die. That's totally okay. Let's... Let's repel ice. It's better than nothing. Now he is definitely okay. I don't know if I need physical amp. I'd rather have like... Hmm. Oh my god. Everything success! I know, joint cracks is definitely another really great quality of life thing from uh from this episode. Okay, I need that crack. I will do whatever it takes to get that crack. Alright, so Mari is over here. You are on the right side, or is that the left side? Where did I have you go? Nalia is there and Kaido is on the very right. Got it. And Nalia is right here. Okay. So I need to edit teams a little bit. So instead of devotion, um oh wait, I only have so much phantasma. You technically have phantasma, which is great. Just so I move a little bit quicker here. Uh Mari's gonna walk. Kaido has phantasma to move around quicker. And now he also has Phantasma to move around quicker. This is going to be terrible. Um, <laughs> I am not confident. Woo! Oh. All right, I'm gonna do a save state so I don't have to do that again. Save state. All right, let's do it. Hmm. That. Hmm. 
do now, yeah. Can he handle it? I guess this technically can be okay. is dead. Dual shadow rocked. That's what we like to see. Alright, nice. Miss! You cannot be for real, bitch. Arachi having multi-strike is actually really terrifying. Um, I hope I don't die. Maybe I can catch her eyes? I'm a little bit scared. I might die. Oh, there's Kuchulain. Choo choo train. Brong is out of MP, which is great. I feel safe. Uh, let's just. I don't want to do Holy Dance and, like, accidentally kill something I'm not meant to kill. So, we're just gonna kill the Barong and that's it. Is there a Makar card? No, there isn't. Son of a fuck! Please kill something. That killed a chicken, I guess, but like, oof. 69? No, Norn! Fucker! I'm so dead. Oh boy, I'm dead. Go ahead, go after Nalia. Yeah, I fucking dare you. And of course, Grace triggers, but whatever. I can take him.
All right, wish me luck. Oh boy. Dude, if Lakshmi dies, I'm gonna cry. Lakshmi's probably gonna die and I'm gonna cry, but that's fine. What if I Tetracarn? It's the only thing I can do. But it might help me. Oh shit! I got it! <gasps> I got multi strike. Is this. Is everything dead now? help now he out. <laughs> he got a little bit bugged. Help save. Okay. Kaido, don't fuck this up. Really good. Please don't kill me. Oh, Lakshmi's dead. What else is new? That's actually going to be really helpful. Yes, set health save. <laughs> I don't think now yet has a raise. So do I do this mid-combat? I think it's better if I try to raise mid-combat so that I save the Samari Farm for Lakshmi. Wait, Oreo's wearing a belt? You know, I never looked, but I'm kind of afraid to. That worked out literally perfectly. Yes, even the level up. Oh, oh. Ugh, I can't. What do you think about this game? I fucking love it so much. Kind of obsessed. Mari's gonna die or something. Because with the Chaos Wave, I won't be able to, to, to defend. Oh, 
don't fucking dual shadow prayer. God damn it. is dead? Well, yet. Yeah, Mari is definitely gonna die, but it's okay. There we go! This touch panel is a piece of junk. They must have used a cheap engineer. <laughs> I like that he judges like every step of the way. Oh, Mari gets to move first. I thought Oreo would be moving first. We got really lucky there. Reflect physical, null physical. Good thing we don't need that. But the reflect wind is more brutal. For sure. Fucking hell. God, this enemy is fucking ass. Oh, and they just killed Norn, you fucker. This is gonna be impossible. Kate, please, do whatever you can. That's something. Holy shit. doing a new game plus run of this game and the second one? Hell no. I don't have enough time on stream. I gotta cover other Whoa. games. I can't keep, uh, I can't keep playing this game. God, I don't have Pierce. Oreo has Pierce, interesting. I could just gun it. We could just see what Deathbound does, but it's gonna be, it's gonna be shit. It's worth a try. I thought you know. Oh! Wait, does the... Oh my god, does the pierce work through my own... Oh my god, I thought I was safe because I had null physical. But because I pierce, that means whenever it reflects, it pierces myself. Oh my god. That's some 5,000 IQ bullshit right there. By the way, those panels have to be controlled simultaneously. Wait, they already do work. Um, we already controlled them. Anyway. Do I need- I do need Phantasma. 
I don't need Blep anymore. I could ditch Blep. These guys, oh, the multi-strike is definitely a concern. I gotta do it though. If I can squeeze my way out of this, <laughs> probably not. That's a good drain, but still. Well, now, yeah. Well, well, well. Why is he staying in my distance? I just want to kill something, please, please. Okay, I killed the Mithras. I killed both of them! <gasps> That's a big deal. I bother? There's nothing I could do against them. I have hmm, nothing. Let's see here. Y'all, this is really ass. I'm not not sure how to get out of this. Yeah, like this is Mega pee pee poo poo extra ass. That's when you know it's bad. Mega pee pee poo poo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's it's bad. I believe I can win. So this isn't like a lost cause at least. Really? Bro, you cannot be serious. Now ya, yeah. you can you'll you'll be okay, right?
Okay, that was good damage. That was actually really, really good. Um, let's see if it can happen again. Oh god, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I killed an old man! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you're still in it. Now you still got it. Now, now you might be dead, but it's fine. I'm out of MP. I need to drain. <laughs> oh god, I'm fucking dead. I killed the multi-strike, that's a big deal. And now I'm out of MP. <laughs> I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm not okay! God damn it, Naoya. Damn. It's okay, I didn't need that guy. This is really not a good idea. Because if I don't kill this thing, I, I, I should be able to kill it, but just in case I don't. Yeah, that's a good way to go. Give me back some of my MP back. Alright, Mari is gonna save the day. Alright, we're going to pick up this thing. There we go. There we go. Okay. And now I'm going to raise me. And now I'm gonna do absolutely nothing. Actually, no, that's a lie. I'm gonna get rid of this demon. In favor of... I don't fucking know, man. Mothman? Long live Mothman? Nobody can kill Mothman. Nobody. Feels literally impossible, dude. Oh my god. I'm slowly getting the boss down. It's happening. Look, that's not the boss, even. That's just Oreo. Also, yeah, you're right. Why does Oreo have a belt? It's literally just to hold the. Um, the sheath for his for his sword. But why does Oreo have a sword in the first place? Anyway, anyway, I have so many questions. So if I attack you, nothing bad's gonna happen. So here's the pro move here. I guard. Mothman, freak arms. With his genitals? I mean, he has a giant mouth and teeth you just eat, like boar. Uh, that's, that's how you attack.
All right, guys, I'm really doing stuff now because now I can revive two things. So I can revive... Nalia? This is probably a really bad idea, but I'm doing it anyway. Oh, boy. Oh, wait, I thought I had Lakshmi available. Uh, Lakshmi was just revived, so I guess not. Welcome back, brother. You're not looking so good, brother. Poor Kaido over here. I needed to raise my elephant. I thought I had Samari Karm available and then I didn't. This strat is still working. I am not quite dead yet. This is going really good. This is literally just a standstill. Nothing else can happen. I'm just draining Oreo to death. And Dual Shadow just keeps procking, and I love that for us. It's like the slowest standstill over here. Just save yourself, Mothman. Please don't kill Lakshmi. Are you- <sighs> Why? I'm so dead. It's Joe over. Mm, yeah, hey, now yeah. It's looking like it might be a good idea to run, buddy. Oh, maybe I could drain this guy. I could get the initiative and drain above his MP, but that's very dangerous. You know what? Uh, running looks like a great thing to do right now. Alright, we still got this, though. Uh, okay, I will revive the elephant. We're still fine. I, I don't feel like a, I'm too much in a bad spot. It's a bad spot, but I still think that we could do it. Alright, we're going to recarm. Let's recarm you. Blep. I love blep. So close. We're, we're getting there. Oh boy, four. Oh man, they're going after the elephant because of course they are. And then this, okay, the elephant is silenced again. I, I love this game. I, I love this game. It's, it's such a, this is a great video game. 
I, I did it. I did it, guys. Kaido did it. Wow. So proud of him. Can you not kill Blup? Alright, I'm I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, um I'm gonna go right here. Are you Kill the chicken. I, I'm draining all of the MP that I possibly can. Every sliver of MP is being drained. I need to kill Belbereth. I'm sick of this fight. <laughs> Here's the deal. We Samari Karm, Lakshmi first. This is what I should have done before. Okay. I think we're just gonna leave it at this. Yeah, I guess we gotta. Should I kill the spring first? There's nothing to drain, but I feel like I should kill the spring first. Uh, there, there's not much to drain there, but I will take the 25 MP that is there. <laughs> Kaido, you're doing great, sweetie. Really proud of you. You're doing fantastic. This is, this is gonna go great. Do I let him attack me first? No, I should take the initiative. Kaido might die. Oh, that's okay, right? Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Doing damage. Yes! <laughs> Look at me doing damage, Mom! Oh, that's not gonna kill because of Endure. God damn. It's okay, though.
here drain that fucker. I'm telling you guys, as soon as I get revived, this uh, bell is gonna die. That guy's got dying so hard, I'm telling you. All right, I'm back, baby. I, okay, I know I'm running out of MP, which is absolutely problematic, but <laughs> um, I need to... You know what? I'm just not going to do anything. Oh, I thought I had... Oh, I got rid of a faction... No, a uh, phantasm... I got rid of... I'm an idiot! Alright, so we recarm blep. Everyone's back. Everyone is back. Nobody's dead. And then we're going to give Nalia some affection. He needs some affection. We're so back. Running out of MP though, so it's a little bit scary. But it's okay. Wow, this is quite the, um, what the fuck just happened? Going after now, yeah. Blup! Oh, Blup almost died. Going after me? Ha ha ha, you have chosen death, bitch. Oh my god, Lakshmi didn't die! It's a goddamn miracle. Lakshmi's alive. Mari gets more MP by being in combat, so we really gotta get into combat here. You piece of shit. Oh wait, no, that's actually good. Okay, uh... Lep can't even use devil speed. I have to use a prayer. Do you know how much mileage I'm gonna get out of burn my bread? Yeah, you guys, uh, if you want the burn your bread emote, now is the time to get it. Should I go after Mr. Belvereth? I don't think so. I feel like I need to drain this guy of everything that he holds dear. Drain every drop of MP. All of it. Blip! Give me your MP. You could get free burn your bread with the Twitch Prime, that's so true. Wow, it's crazy. Also, even better for Persona 3 Reload, the, the hype emote we have is the best. I, I love the FemC hype emote.
So you get bread and femsi. <clears throat> what is Kaido doing? Like, actually. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> Bitch, I have no idea what we're doing. Belbereth once again going after Nalia, thinking that he can kill him, but then he prays, and then I'm fine. No, look! This is just like a rinse and repeat. I love Grace. Okay. Mari? I feel like it's too dangerous for Mari to go after Belbereth. I'm a little bit scared about that. But at the same time, if I don't get into combat with her, um, we're, we, our MP is never going to get replenished. So I feel like we got to do this. worked out well. Oof, so scary. Oh, uh, we're running out of MP everywhere, so it's a, it's a bit scary. Blep versus Blep. Blep one. I will tell you which one. Left versus the world. Wait, Belvereth basically is Bel- yeah, like, the basically the world. Alright, Mari. I can use Elect Dance now. We are going places. We're gonna kill it. We're gonna kill it. We're gonna kill it. Just keep saying that out loud and one day it'll be true. We're gonna kill it. Kaido has been struggling with like the same two enemies the entire time. All right, it's time. I need to end this. Probably not with Mothman. Um, I'm sorry, Mothman. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Rangda. All right, multi-strike is going to kill this thing single-handedly.
Lakshmi's dead. That's it. That's Belbereth. One shot. Go to Babel as you intended and reign there as the King of Bell. It has been a long, long journey. The bells will finally become one. I did it. I beat the game. Actually, I don't think that's the end of the game. Did it. That was such a satisfying ending. Now even Belbereth's power of Bell belongs to you. There's no one left who can stand in your way. <laughs> okay. Now Good job. Go. All the preparations are done. So you're going to access the summoning server right now, yeah? Is this where you controlled the server from before? That's right. That is, until Belbereth took the server back into the demon realm. The main server is already inside Babel, and its properties are changing. But, as long as the server's components are still there, the network should be alive. When things get that extreme, my brain can only imagine so much. <laughs> you need to study more. But enough <laughs> idle banter. You need to study more. He can become King of Bell now. Once we're ready, we'll face the final trial. Final trial? I'm not quite ready for a final trial. Oh shit. Uh, okay. That wasn't in my uh, to-do list of today. To beat the game? Ooh, do I want to beat it? Oh, I can get Shiva! The classic Barong and Rangda make Shiva every game, man. You already have anti-most. All right, we got Shiva. I think that's the only one I can get, yeah. Now you know it's really the end of the game when I got Shiva. Look at that. It's really the end. Um... Uh, I'm actually going to end it there for the day. So that we'll continue it on... Ooh! Why do I always yawn at the end of my stream? It's like, just whenever I'm done. But yeah, I'm going to end it there. I just saved three times in a row. Yeah, I, d I just did that. Alright. Thank you guys for this week's streams. I really appreciate it. Thank you for all the support today. I really appreciate that. I, by the way, as an update, I am still undecided about the Persona 3 Marathon. I think what I'm going to have to do is... I, I like the idea of a Marathon Subathon for Persona 3. So I would just be playing Yakuza 8, and I would play Persona 3 on day one, but I would probably just do one stream and come back to it later for the Subathon, because I think I would just rather play Yakuza 8, honestly. So it might just be that way, and then depending on the time left over, I will have a Persona 3 subathon 
whether it's uh, after FF7 Rebirth, I'm not 100% sure yet. If I can do it after Yakuza 8 and then maybe push back FF7, that's an idea. Uh, but yeah, so I think what I'm changing my schedule to, instead of playing two games at the same time, I'm just going to solely play Yakuza 8. We'll play Persona 3 on the first day on February 2nd. And then the next week I immediately go back to Infinite Wealth. Um, and then after Infinite Wealth, the subathon possibly happens. But yeah, thank you guys so much for the stream. That's the plan. And I hope you have a good weekend. Stay safe if you're in areas where there's big snowstorms coming. Because, uh, yeah, that's happening right now. And yeah, see you guys on Monday. And I'll be back on Monday in my apartment. So this is the last time you see this boring-ass background. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Have a good one.